All right, welcome back. All right, so I I, I want to say this was one of uh, playing through Shovel Knight and Plague Knight are some of my hedgehog. <laughs> <laughs> playing through Shovel Knight and Plague Knight are some of my favorite playthroughs that we've done on the show, just because I love doing the voices. So I'll probably do that. Edge bomb. <laughs> See, he's edgy. Oi, the edge bomb. Oi, um, you think edgy you do? Oi. Oh, we'll be the judge of that, we will. What the fuck, Joey? <laughs> he did a yeah, good job. That that was really done well. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm sure my accent was absolutely horrible. And I was just reading what I saw. No, it's got to be the, the Australian one from Worms. Who's that fairy? <laughs> uh, she. You can use an amiibo to get a little fairy to follow you. I actually have not done that. I love this world, dude. Yeah. Oh, yeah. So this is the little hub world. This is like like where he lives. After after you beat a knight, he'll be here eating. So it's it's actually pretty funny. Is it eating the bones. No, I like, like <laughs> waiting for food, I guess I should say. What the fuck? The fish eggs? I don't know what these are, but if you toss one over to the cat, he'll play with it and give him gold. What the fuck? I'm so curious. <laughs> yeah, I have, I have no idea. I have no what idea. is that? Let us know in the comments what you <laughs> think it is. It's a, it's a I, fish I, egg! I'm so intrigued by this little thing now. Are you a cat? <laughs> it I looks mean, like, like a fish egg. Yeah. Just like, I have no idea what they are. Do they, do they serve any other purpose in the nope, game? No, that's, it, that's, it, that's the only thing I found. Oh my god. Meow. Is it? Cat, don't do it! <laughs> oh, I was hoping he'd bump into them all and they'd all like collapse and it'd be real cute. Oh. Are you picturing them collapsing around the cat? He caught it! Yes. He caught uh, it. He caught He's it. He's chewing yeah. at it. Mm -hmm. Alright, good for you, little oh. shit. Cat. Chest monster. There's another kitty. Oh, look at that guy. The skeleton? Yeah. Yeah. Like him. Uh, he's the one that gives me the, the curios, which again are my items. But first I'm offering gold to this thing, and then I can later buy cloaks from him, which act like the new armors. Yeah. Yeah, that would make good cosplay. <sighs> so obviously I can't afford any right now because I just gave him all my fucking money. Hmm. But whatever. Red. I have a mask like that, it's not red. With the, the skull? Yeah. The skull mask? So, so this is pretty cool. You trade the, He's looking for his lost love, and you trade red skulls to him, uh, and he'll give you these curios. But uh, And then you'll go through like a little gauntlet where it basically teaches you how to use it, or like what it's for. So the one I got restores health. Uh -huh. So pretty useful. Uh, especially for boss battles. That 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 one was invaluable in uh, the one where I, I uh, in my playthrough where I couldn't upgrade my will, but it was unusable for the playthrough Wait, that I didn't have will where everything was just dark darkness meter. Okay. Yeah, so I, there was no refilling in health. Oh yeah, because you'd use it and you'd hurt yourself. Yeah. One thing. Uh, if, if you've played the other campaigns, but not this one, uh, one thing they did here that I, I like better than the other ones is that they gave uh, items a dedicated button. In the old, in the other games, you have to use the up and plus attack button, which I, which is fine, but sometimes you do it accidentally, and I hated that. Uh, so I like that they gave you a dedicated button to to actually use it here. Interesting. Yeah. Anyway. This is the hub world, off we go. So another cool thing about this, I don't know if you guys remember uh, the other two campaigns, but you were on an overworld map. In here, there's no overworld map. We're on a hub, and the Dark Acolyte here, Hail, Lord Spectre Knight, glory to the Intentress. She has entrusted me to operate this dark portal. Cross through it, and you'll reach your target in a mere moment. Okay, so there's no uh, There's no traveling. overworld. Yeah. yeah. Shall I choose. prepare the magic mirror for your departure, my lord? And we can choose any knight to go to. That's awesome. So I'll let you guys choose. Who, where should I go? We've got... uh, I want to go by color. I'll go by color. Don't tell me. Okay. Uh, orange. Orange. We're going to the Lost City. I look more red to me. Oops, I pushed the wrong button. We were just playing on a PS4, so I'm used to bottom button. You know? <laughs> oh, yeah. The, the, the oh, permanent. Yeah, no. yeah. That's actually... Uh, switching, switching between a Nintendo console and any other console is like a chore just because of the, the cancel and and uh, affirmative, uh, affirmation buttons are, are reversed. I don't remember uh, what ch YouTube channel it was that recently did it, but it was uh, basically a things game uh, thing bad habits gamers 
have are not not bad habits, but you know something like that. One of them was uh, the uh, switching between consoles. Uh huh. Yeah, and um, basically having to relearn like that for that short amount of time. Your controls. So yeah, that's funny. I I've, I've absolutely never had a problem with with. Uh, Controls like you tell me to push A, I'll push A no matter if I'm on a Nintendo console or if I'm on Xbox. Okay. Uh, you tell me to push triangle, I know where that is. You tell me to push square, I know where that is, right? I've never had a problem with that, but it's just confirmation and affirmation that I'll, I'll or uh, confirmation and and what's the other one? To go back. Uh, cancellation, I should, I should guess. That I'll, I'll confuse all the time when when I start switching between consoles. Um. But other than that, I, I I really never have a problem with yeah. with with actual control. I mean, I've made fun of you for yeah. for saying PS4 controls for a for a non PS4 system or non Sony system. Yeah, I mean, I've I've only really played Sony games for so long that it's just built in already. So I do have that really bad habit of calling something an X button when it's not. <laughs> <laughs> As I guess, technically speaking, the, the the Sony systems don't have an X button. They use shapes, so they have a cross button. Okay, Joey. <laughs> Honestly, that's not even my own argument. I, I, I read that somewhere, and I had that same reaction. I was like, shut the fuck up. <laughs> yeah, that's awesome. I don't know. Well, I, that's why we're friends. <laughs> <laughs> I, I had that exact same reaction when I put it in. Just because you, you mentioned it now, I thought I should say it. <laughs> Piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love you so much. <laughs> I mean, it is true though. The 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 part of me that wants to be correct above all else. I, I know. I already said I love you. you can stop. <laughs> <laughs> just stop. <laughs> well, I'm just mentioning it because, like I, I said, I agreed with you. <laughs> Oh, fucking, oh, I like that guy with his fucking root. No. Just saying, just saying I like him. But no, I don't. You've <laughs> <laughs> been like every single one. Yeah, he has been. Ah, get away. Yeah. <laughs> oh, look at that. I remember that guy. And his fucking dope ass gun rod. Gun rod? <laughs> gun rod? Yeah. Would you like a gun rod, Matt? Fuck yeah, I would. I would too, honestly. It's called a rifle. <laughs> <laughs> Touche, Admiral. Oh, you. <laughs> oh, oh, shit! Oh, so, oh, my God. Stop it, Joey. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I like about Spectre Knight. He actually has a lot of traversal... Uh, it's also kind of like, it's real easy to accidentally hit a wall and start climbing up a wall that you don't want to climb up on. But he has a lot of recovery options, so that's pretty cool. I think, I think in terms of, of like obstacle movement and stuff, Spectre Knight has the best in terms of that. It seems like it. Yeah. Uh, as opposed I, to, to, to even, even like Plague Knight's little bomb jump thing was cool, but I prefer the way Spectre Knight moves. Yeah, I, I was about to say I do really like uh, his his the, his uh, his flow. In his movement, that's the thing too. And, and again, it's probably because I'm practiced, you know, because I played it so much. Oh yeah, you make it look that that like I, I can kind of I can yeah. kind of flow from from obstacle to obstacle right now because I, I just, just because I've done so much. Honestly, it was it was a, it was like a bit of a learning curve when I started. I, I was falling into every single pit and and not properly timing my my swipes, so so it could be a bit of a hassle starting off, but. Uh, I mean, this is fun. I, I was saying before, Yacht, Yacht Club game. Damn, I cannot say that. Yacht Club Games did a fantastic job. I think just with, with Shovel Knight, and then releasing these DLCs for free is fucking robbery, man. I'd easily pay full price for each of these uh, iterations. Yeah, yeah, each of these campaigns. Yeah, and, and they all and seem worth free. it, man. Yeah, like yeah. totally, totally. You, 
And, I, and Ozzy, uh, they recently announced Destiny 2, and I have a bad taste in my mouth from Destiny. Because Destiny 1 sold me a $60 game, and then made me pay it again for the fixed version of that game. <laughs> and if you didn't, you couldn't play it. And if you didn't, you couldn't play it. And you couldn't play a lot of what you already paid for. Piss me off to no end. Because I like Destiny, I thought it was a pretty fun game. Yeah, I have a lot of... Uh... Friends from work who are uh, diehard Destiny players, but definitely left a bad taste in my mouth. So I won't. I, like I will not get Destiny Two at least not until like they have a Game of the Year edition with everything in it for half the price, because they burned me once already. Um, this game, on the other hand, you pay. I ah oh, fuck me. Uh, this game oh really my god, little bats on the fucking bags, I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't see that the first time you died. <laughs> Um, this game, on the other hand, 15 bucks originally, it's 25 now, uh, still worth it, in my opinion. Uh, 15 bucks originally, um, with two free campaigns on top of the original game. Yeah, absolutely phenomenal, man. And uh, amiibo support. And amiibo support, yeah, like, like, uh, I don't know. I, I, I support this company, seriously. Yacht, Yacht Club Games, I can't wait to see what they do next. If they keep doing Shovel Knight, that's cool too. But I, 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 I mean, this is the kind of company that I'm happy to give money to. Uh, next time on the Gamers Brewery, uh, more gushing about uh, this game. Mm -hmm. See you guys later. Bye bye.